Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. Faced with the frequently revised restriction rules in the United States, it is estimated that ASML is also very helpless. This Dutch lithography machine manufacturer does not want to lose the Chinese market, but just wants to do business safely. The United States has been repeatedly advised not to restrict shipments, otherwise the global supply chain will be disrupted. However, things have developed to the point where ASML is out of control. The Netherlands has decided to implement the export control rules for DUV lithography machines on September 1st. ASML officially announced that 7 nanometers lithography machines can be shipped to the mainland. Foreign media, the purpose behind it is not simple. How important is the Chinese market to ASML? China's semiconductor industry is developing rapidly, and more and more chip manufacturers need advanced lithography equipment to meet market demand. ASML's lithography machines are in a leading position in performance and technology, so they are highly competitive in the Chinese market. China is also vigorously supporting the development of the local semiconductor industry, which provides more opportunities for ASML's business growth in the Chinese market. Faced with such a broad market prospect, ASML once announced that it would increase the annual production capacity of DUV lithography machines to 600 units. As for the EUV lithography machine, although it has also set an annual production target of 90 units, it does not make sense to have more production capacity if it cannot be shipped to the Chinese mainland market. What makes ASML feel helpless is that most of the DUV lithography equipment will also limit shipments. Dutch officials have made a decision to implement the export control rules for DUV lithography machines from September 1st. After all, the Netherlands took this step. Even after months of negotiations between China and the Netherlands, the Netherlands failed to change its mind. As a party, ASML naturally cannot stay out of the matter, and officially announced that it needs to apply for an export license from the Netherlands in order to ship the most advanced immersion DUV lithography machine. At the same time, ASML also emphasized that not all DUV lithography machines will be restricted. According to the ASML official website, there are three mainstream immersion DUV lithography machines, namely TwinScan NXT, 1980DI, TwinScan NXT, 2000I, and TwinScan NXT, 2050I. Among these three models, only the NXT, 1980DI can be shipped normally and the other two models require an export license. In other words, the most advanced equipment that manufacturers in mainland China can purchase from ASML is NXT, 1980DI. It stands to reason that the equipment that can be shipped is not the most advanced, and only old equipment can be traded freely, so that Western countries do not have to worry about other countries making major scientific and technological innovation breakthroughs. But NXT, 1980DI lithography machine theoretically still produces 7 nanometers high-end chips with energy. What's going on? In fact, only multiple exposure and multilayer lithography techniques are required to achieve higher resolution and smaller chip size. The lithography machine uses light as a knife 
to lithography the chip pattern on the surface of the wafer. The higher the precision of the lithography machine, the higher the resolution, and it can easily expose high-end chips such as 7 nanometers and 5 nanometers. The efficiency of one exposure of the EUV lithography machine is several times that of the ordinary DUV lithography machine, but in the case of multiple exposures by the DUV lithography machine, the chip pattern can be repeatedly photo etched, and a clearer chip circuit diagram can be copied on the wafer. Surface Of course, the disadvantages are also obvious, that is, the cost of multiple exposures is high and the yield rate is low. If chip manufacturers use NXT 1980DI to manufacture 7 nanometers chips, they may be able to achieve mass production, but they may not be able to achieve a good pass rate. Such chips do not have strong competitiveness in the market and may damage the company's reputation. To be on the safe side, most chip manufacturers use NXT 1980DI lithography machines to manufacture 14 nanometers, 28 nanometers, and other mature process chips to ensure sufficient chip production capacity. Some foreign media said, the purpose behind it is not simple. In theory, 7 nanometers lithography machines can be shipped to the mainland, but in fact it is not so easy for Western countries to let China break through high-end chips. The Netherlands does not restrict the shipment of all DUV lithography machines. It obviously hopes that China will continue to purchase ASML lithography machines. The business that should be done must be done, which not only complies with the requirements of the US rules, but also does not completely lose the Chinese market. The matter has come to this point. It is time to recognize the true colors of the Netherlands. At the critical moment, the Netherlands will not stand from the perspective of free trade, but choose to join forces with the United States. China's lithography machine industry should rely on its own strength to break the situation and abandon the illusion of importing high-end lithography machines from abroad. China can increase support for domestic lithography machine manufacturers, encourage them to increase R&D investment and production capacity, and improve the production capacity and technical level of domestic lithography machines or increase investment in research and development of lithography machine technology, promote technological innovation, and improve the performance and accuracy of domestic lithography machines. Through independent R&D and innovation, China can reduce its dependence on external technology and improve its technological competitiveness. In terms of personnel training in the field of lithography machines, cultivate more lithography machine engineers and technical personnel. By introducing and cultivating professional talents, China can improve its voice in the field of lithography machines. From the perspective of improving domestic production capacity, technological innovation, and personnel training, it may not be impossible to break the rule blockade to deal with the challenge of the Dutch blockade of lithography machine shipments. ASML knows very well that China will speed up its self-research efforts due to restrictions. Once China makes a final breakthrough, it will be difficult for lithography machines to enter China. This day will come sooner or later. If you agree with the point of view of this video, please like it, welcome to forward, leave a message and share.